Now it's time to take a look at what's in my dock. The dock I use these days is Avant Window Navigator. It's a good dock. I usually go back and forth between this one and uh, Docky. They're both really awesome docks. But this is what I got in my dock. First thing you're going to see, obviously, is my web browser of choice, Firefox. Now, I do like Chrome and Chromium. They're really groovy browsers. But Firefox has been my home for a long time. And I guess I'm a little stuck in the ways of the Firefox. But after that, we have Pigeon, hands down the best instant messenger client that I've ever used because it's multi-platform and incredibly simple and lightweight. I like it. Then we have XChat, something I really should use more often, but I just don't <laughs> use as often as I should. The GIMP, obviously, because I do a lot of artwork. Ardour, the best multi-track recording software on the planet. I absolutely love that program. It's programs like Ardour, which make it like hard for me to use Windows. Then Caden Live, an amazing video editor that I used, of course, to edit this video. Handbrake, which if you're not using Handbrake to make MP4 files, it makes them beautifully every time. It's fast, it's lightweight, multi-platform. It can go right from a DVD, it can go from a file. Whenever I make a video on Caden Live, I usually just render out to a, a nigh lossless format and then compress it with a uh, handbrake for my YouTube uploads. Then of course, Shotwell. Shotwell standard in Ubuntu. I'm running Mint now, um, so I'd actually apt get it. I really like Shotwell. It's way better than FSpot was, and it's a lot lighter and a lot faster. I have a terminal emulator. And this program is called GUVC View. It's the best webcam tool on the planet. That's why I do like almost all my webcam capturing with. And then of course, LibreOffice Writer for documents. Gedit, which is my favorite text editor besides Nano. That's a whole other animal though. Brazaro CD Burner for burning music CDs for my friends and family. And of course, the anonymous Linux ISO if I need to. After that, uh, it's just my clock. Trash can, weather, and uh, CPU. So yeah. That's all there is there. All right. And that's what in my dock. What I think would be kind of fun is if we can get like some video responses on what you guys have in your, your start bar, your dock, whatever you use to launch your favorite applications and whatnot, and what applications you think are missing from my start bar. Also, if you have a Twitter account and you like my videos, subscribe to my Twitter feed link in the doobly-doo i mean yeah so video responses if you want or just leave a comment below and i'm gonna try to keep the classiness level of my videos up a little higher so pinkies out everybody